Hello, welcome back to my channel. My name is Tom Caldwell and my website is TomCaldwellOnline.com and both on my YouTube channel and my website, I teach you how to make money online without wasting time and money. In today's video, I'm going to cover the subject, when is the best time for a beginner to monetize their content, whether it be a blog or a YouTube channel. And uh, before we do that, I'd like to say, if you haven't already subscribed to my channel, please do so, so that you will be notified each time I upload new uh, content. And I do so on a weekly basis. Also, if you find value in this uh, video, please give me a thumbs up because that helps more people find my training content on YouTube. So let's get right into the subject. Let's go to the computer. Okay, now we're on my blog post. And like I said, the title is, When is the best time to monetize your blog or content? My, I have included a little picture on my blog, and here's the little introduction. There is a matter of opinion among experienced online marketers as to whether or not a beginner should monetize immediately or monetize later. And in this blog post, you will learn the answer. I've included a video tutorial, but if you prefer written instructions, just keep reading. Monetize or not to monetize? Should a beginner monetize or wait until later? That is the question. In the past, I've been of the opinion that a beginner should concentrate on building their audience first and then uh, monetize after about 90 days. However, as I build my business online on a daily basis, I've come to the conclusion that it's better to have your monetization in place early. The benefit of monetizing early. My line of thinking is that build your audience and monetize at the same time, because if you wait, you may miss out on uh, possible uh, potential sales and lose out on earning your commissions. And of course, I want you to make money online as fast as possible. As an online marketer, your main goal is to provide quality content that answers niche questions, educates, or helps to do something faster, che easier, cheaper, etc. But uh, decide as soon as you possibly uh, can what product, service, or software will be best to serve your audience and sign up for an affiliate program and include your affiliate links in your content where appropriate. The benefit of building an email list. All successful online marketers are building an email list. An email list is the best method to monetize your blog or YouTube content. Here is a uh, story that explains why an, an email list is so important. This story is about one of my mentors, and I'll call, it his, I'll call him Miles. Prior to the demise of MySpace, Miles built a huge audience on MySpace. After years of struggle, he finally thought that he had hit the big time. He was earning about $10,000 per month, but he had not collected email addresses from his audience. Then that fateful day came when Facebook knocked MySpace off its pedestal. Guess what happened to Miles's, what, guess what happened to the income that Miles had grown accustomed to? That's right, the income disappeared, vanished into thin air. But Miles being the resourceful guy that he is, learned a hard lesson and from that point on, he began building a list at the same time that he was building his new Facebook audience. Now, of course, the moral of the story is build your audience on your favorite platform, but switch them to your email list as soon as possible. And you do this by getting an email management system, which I recommend uh, get response before because it's the for the beginner it's the easiest uh system out there i've tried several 
and um, you can uh, build your list up to 1,000 subscribers uh, for like $9 a month or something. So it's very economical. It's, in, it's a price that anybody can afford. Once you get your email management system in place, build a valuable giveaway, which the giveaway is called a lead magnet. And that uh, you, you offer your lead magnet to your audience in exchange for their email. Then once you uh, get their email, you create a three-day follow-up series. Then after that, you email your list on a daily basis with a short email with uh, helpful content related to uh, the the niche, your niche, and uh, you can vary it. You know, vary your daily email. Sometimes give a motiva motivational message or uh, help them answer a question, uh, teach them how to do something new, easier, cheaper educate them just a short email every day to keep in touch with them and uh always uh and, and for more information about building an email list you can i have recommended one of my other blog posts and when you're on my website you can click here and, and read the other blog post as well so here's a checklist for building an audience and an email list from scratch if you're a beginner Number one, choose your niche. Number two, create your blog style website. Number three, decide what product or service you will sell. Number four, set, your, set up your email management account. Number five, create a lead magnet and a three day follow up series. Build your funnel and connect your email management account lead magnet and follow-up series number seven create 12 blog posts during the next 90 days that's only it sounds overwhelming whenever you say 12 blog posts but it's only one per week step number eight is post three times per day on three separate platforms post the same post on each so what you're going to do is you're going to make three blog post you'll do one in the morning on each of your three platforms say uh, you post the same uh, post on Facebook Twitter and LinkedIn and then at noon you would do your <coughs> excuse me you do your second uh, you'd post your second time and you would do that on each of the three platforms and then about 6 p.m you do it again and um when you post you leave a uh, subtle message sending them to your content like your youtube channel or your uh your blog mainly is what we're talking about here and uh of course use the, the 80 20 rule when creating your content and posting your social media the 80 20 rule is um excuse me <coughs> 80% of your content should be educational and only 20% of your content should be promotional. Send your daily email to your audience and rinse and repeat steps six through nine every 90 days. The, in conclusion, if you follow the checklist above, at the end of your first 90 days, your online business will be running like a well-oiled machine. The daily process will be getting easier and faster, and you may even uh, have made a few sales and earned commission. However, if you have not made any sales, do not despair. You are still in the learning process and uh, you are gaining experience. Maintain your momentum and focus on serving your audience and building your email list. Once your audience begins to know, like, and trust you, the sales will start to flow. This is known as the snowball effect. It takes a lot of effort to make a snowball and get it to the edge of the hill. But once it gets started rolling down the hill, there's no stopping it. Any, and uh, online marketing is the same way. You've got to put in the work in the beginning 
And then once you get your momentum going, uh, the snowball of sales begin. And when you those sales start rolling in, you start earning your commissions. Okay, then now here's your call to action. Uh, I always like the quote, action takers are money makers. If you're not already signed up to my daily emails and training, do so now and receive my uh, the same step-by-step -step plan that I use to build my business every day. And this is a this plan is a is a forty nine dollar value, and I give it to you for free. So uh, you can if you're on my blog, you can click this big red button to download the free plan, or I will include it in my description below, as well as. Uh, a link to um, get response uh, where you can get started building your email list and uh, that's all I've got for you today and I will see you on the next video